here it is. All right. I believe the biggest hurdle facing anybody in their life is acknowledging why they should fail. That's it. That's so, it. What do you, you mean have by got that? To be, you have that. got to be more wise about why you should fail than anybody else. I know every fault and weakness that I possess. And what I do when I know those faults and weaknesses, I do my best to make sure that they don't prevent me from succeeding. And there's a lot of people who walk around mm. life thinking that, they, that they're going to do something, yet they don't realize that it may be the way they look or the way they're talking or the way, they, the way they're dressed that might be influencing people to say no. But because they never sit back and recognize their failures or the things that are prohibiting them from being successful, they never correct them. And they constantly go into a spiral of rejection. And ultimately, they try to be a doctor for a problem that they should have long been solved on their own. So it, 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 it is the case. And every one of my mentees, I make them go through the same process of examining their failures and putting in a process and a, 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 a rubric for how they're going to address them and move past them. Right? And once you do that, I mean, there's nothing that can hold you back. Right? I know what's my weakness. So if somebody calls it out to me, say, thank you very much, kindly. Thank you kindly. <laughs> I'm going to keep it moving. And I think that's uh, very important. Very, very, very important.